Approximately 4.5 million Canadians visit a chiropractor each year to have their spines cracked, popped, and adjusted. In addition to back pain, some chiropractors claim to fix an astonishing array of problems, including, in babies, the trauma of passing through the birth canal. Some chiropractors even offer adjustments on pets. The practice of chiropractics is playing a bigger role in healthcare, but few people know it started with a message from a ghost. Daniel David Palmer, who was born in Port Perry, Ontario in 1845, invented the field of chiropractic care. Daniel David moved to Davenport, Iowa when he was 20, where he took up magnetic healing. He also worked as a school teacher, raised bees, and opened a grocery store. Daniel David was a spiritualist. He said the idea for chiropractic came to him from the other world during a seance where he communicated with the spirit of a doctor, Jim Atkinson, who died 50 years earlier. According to Palmer, 95% of all disease is due to subluxations. In chiropractic, subluxation occurs when one or more of the bones of the spine move out of position and create pressure on spinal nerves, causing all sorts of disease by interfering with the flow of nerve impulses between brain and body. Daniel David considered chiropractic a kind of religion, stating in 1911 that the practice must have a religious head, one who is the founder, as did Christ, Muhammad, and others who have founded religions. I am the fountainhead. The local paper referred to him as a quack who claimed he can cure the sick and crippled with his magnetic hands. He opened the Palmer School of Chiropractic in Davenport in 1897. Since then, chiropractic medicine has become a widely used form of alternative treatment in Canada. But skeptics say there's no evidence to support the subluxation theory or the use of spinal manipulation for anything other than uncomplicated neck or back pain. They worry that, in rare cases, people could be harmed, and that people who go to chiropractors who push the subluxation concept and claim they can help with nearly any medical problem could also be exposed to anti-science beliefs, like the debunked notion that vaccines cause autism. In 1906, Daniel David, who also called himself a doctor, was convicted of practicing medicine without a license and went to jail. Legend has it he married at least five times. He died in 1913 at the age of 68. The official cause of death was typhoid fever. Apparently, there was no miraculous adjustment for typhoid.